Hi everyone, I'm going to do the scavenger hunt video. This is the third time because we've done three takes and the second one had no volume. So let's try again, shall we? Hit me with the questions, Miss Money. Find an author's name or title with the letter Z in it. That one. I can't pronounce the name, I'm really sorry. But the author's lovely. Done? Mm -hmm. Okay, next. Find a classic. Jane Eyre. Next. I'm still reading that one. Uh, find a book with a key on it. <laughs> Skeleton key. And you gotta look really closely, but there's this key there. Okay, next. Find something on your bookshelf that's not a book. Bottle of tree blood. Oi! Right here. Bottle of tree blood. Thank you very much. Let's go. Next. Uh, find the oldest book on your shelf. Nineteen forty six. Okay, let's go. Find a book with a girl on the cover. Uh, Amy, Mimi, um, Mani <laughs> Ma, um, Miney. <laughs> Where's Mo? Uh, Mo. <laughs> okay, let's go. Find a book that has an animal on it. In the new. Uh, Tiger's Kiss. Let's go. Find a book with a male protagonist. Death, most definite. Okay. Find a book with only words on it. Gladiatrix. I love arcs, they're easy. <laughs> Next. Find a book with illustrations in it. Margot Lennigan Sea Hearts. Are you even watching to make sure I'm getting the covers in this? Okay. Bitches! Next! Find the book with gold lettering. Oh, uh, I don't know. Okay. Falling to ash. Next! Find a diary. <sighs> Growing Pains of Adrian Mole. Find a book that is written by someone with a common name like Smith. Chan. It's about as common as Smith in China, isn't it? <laughs> Kylie Chan. Okay, next. Find a book that has a close-up of something on it. <laughs> Lips. <laughs> next. Um... Find a book on the shelf that takes place in the earliest time period. The Holy Bible. I'm cheating. Let's go. <laughs> Find a hardcover book without a jacket. Uh, I've got The Prophet by that person. And it's not a dust jacket, it's just satin. So it's kind of cool. Find a teal turquoise coloured book. The Killables by Jim O'Malley. This is an arc, so it probably doesn't count, but. Works for me. Let's go. Book with stars on it. Book with stars on it. We have Kate Forsyth with five stars because there's stars on the cover. Next. Find a non y book. Okay. Shadow Fay by Erica Hayes. Very much not YA. Not children's. A little bit raunchy. Let's go. That's it. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, we're done. That's kind of cool. Bye everyone, take yourselves.